find him. Yeah. Am I talking good? Yeah. And so anything you need from God has already been put in the script. Glory be to God. But you gotta learn how to trust him. You gotta learn how to believe him. Every mistake you made, every heartbreak you had, every disappointment, every setback, they were all ordered by God. They was in the script. He's developing your character. And when you come out, you're gonna come out pure as gold. You're gonna be smarter than you've ever been before. You're gonna be brighter than you've ever been before. You're gonna be more have more wisdom than you've ever been before. If we learn how to embrace the process and quit trying to fight God because your hands are too short to box with God. You can't change or you got to learn how to just trust him. Yeah. Even when you don't like it. Yeah. Who yeah. likes everything that God gives us? Mm -hmm. What child loves spinach? <laughs> Come on, talk to me a minute. Mm -hmm. Man, kids want to eat that Cheerio. Mm -hmm. if, you had, if, you, if we asked Tater what she want to eat today, she might say, I want me some potato chips and some gummy bears and some gumdrops. I want me some chocolate snickers. Uh, give me a, uh, uh, give me a, uh, a chocolate covered marshmallow. Mm -hmm. uh, give me an Easter bunny. Give me some jelly beans. Yeah, yeah, Come on, talk yeah. to me over here. Give yeah, me some fruit yeah. loops. Don't give me no yeah. cherry oh. uh -huh. <laughs> Am I talking good? Yeah, yeah, she's a child. Yeah. She's a novice. So she has to trust her parents that, mm -hmm. that when her mama grind up some bananas and mix it with some spinach and some peas, that that's what's nutritious for her. Uh -huh. Well, if Elder Samson know how to be a good mother to her daughter, what do you think God know how to be for you when he's the heavenly father? Mm -hmm. If we know how to give good gifts to our children, what about God? Mm -hmm. He knows what's best for you. If it's something that you've been praying for and you don't have, that means you ain't supposed to have it right now. Right. Right. That's right. That's right. And we gotta learn to trust him mm -hmm. when we don't understand it. Trust is, I don't like this. But I know you got me sometimes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's terrible, God. It's feeling bad up in here. I feel like you left me alone by myself to deal with these mm -hmm. things. But when you trust it, you just lean back and say, you know what? I resolve I ain't going to deal with that. Mm -hmm. That's your problem, God, and not mine. And guess what? He, he's a problem solver. Yes, he, yeah. he can handle all the stuff that's wrong with us. Yeah. And this is what, what, what they were talking about with the children of Israel in Deuteronomy 29. They said, you've seen the works of God before. Mm -hmm. And isn't it something how we have selective amnesia? We've seen what God is able to do, mm -hmm. and we still have trouble trusting him, don't we? Mm -hmm. You know why? Because I'm wondering, have we ever trusted him in the first place? Mm -hmm. Because when you have something, you enhance it mm -hmm. or it increases. Mm -hmm. But when you don't have something, you just didn't have it from the get-go. Mm -hmm. Amen. Mm -hmm. So what we got to learn to trust him. And guess what else? He's going to teach us to trust him. Mm -hmm. You're not going to have a choice in the matter. Amen. So even when he scaled down, look, look at how God has brought us. Was anybody tested like we've been in, the, in this bad economy? You've had to trust God when you, I mean, you didn't know where it was coming from there. You didn't, them people didn't give you no raise and no.